Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to learn how to fetch data from database by using voice command. I have a program to perform this activity. Okay, let me explain about this program step by step. Okay, first of all, import PYTTSX3 library. This library is used for audio related activities and speech recognition. This is used to recognize our voice command based on the commands. And mysql.connector is used to connect database to the program. Okay, so here you can see host, that means local. now I am running this database in local host. So here I can give host name as local host and the root is user is root and password based on your requirement and a database name is db ecom stock and once database connected to the program print function will print successfully connected to database okay fine and engine variable is used to initiate sapi file from aptsx3 model and voice variable is declared to get property that means get voice property from this engine and engine dot set property that means what type of voice we are going to get from this voice property here you can change number if you want a female voice or male voice in this portion and speak function is used to activate audio process from this portion and take command is used to listen our voice using microphone as the source and the program will start to recognize our voice and store this data in query if we didn't give any information or comment in the voice then a program will throw this command like waiting for your command so we can start to speak and this will go to the main part here our voice command is stored in query variable and take to recognize and match with the data base here if query execute select star from balance table let me show you the database and table okay so here you can see a table called db underscore e-commerce stock and in this you can see balance table in balance table there is a list of data set first one is account number and name and balance based on the command the program will start to match the data in balance table where account number is matched in query and this will fetch all data from this data table and store in d variable and speak function will tell us your outstanding balance on the account is D. That means the exact outstanding balance on this particular account. Okay, let's go for a try now. Okay, so here you can see successfully connected to database. Okay, so here you can see listening. 9830. Your outstanding balance on account is 9830. Cash app Shankar Gosh, dollar 100. 9873. Your outstanding balance on account is 9873. Mukesh Kumar, dollar 1, 600. 9824. Your outstanding balance on account is 9824. Devon Rajesh by Bondari, dollar two comma two hundred. In this way, you can start to build your own program on artificial intelligence to get the data from database. Thanks, guys, for watching this video. I will come up with another interesting video very soon.